Hi, I'm Murray Wilkinson from Future Gen Solutions, and this afternoon I want to do a presentation about why retirement fails. And this is a big issue these days because we've got a lot of online communication happening, uh, Dr. Google and all the rest of it, and I think they would put that down as the first factor as to why retirement fails. Online calculators. They are the bane of our lives because people often go on these short form calculators and try and work out their retirement and where they sit. In most cases, these are very notional and they are yards, miles apart from where the actual reality of your situation may be. So that's the first reason. The second thing is reliance on rule of thumbs. One of the rule of thumbs that people often use is, oh, I'll be able to get a 7% return, an 8% return. You know, uh, I only need you know, X dollars, that'll give me an 8% return and, and I'll be okay for the rest of my life. It isn't as simple as that. Um, depending on investment cycles, depending on your drawdown rate, it's, there's got to be more science in it than using a rule of thumb calculation. That's the second area. Third area is the failure to calculate your own lifestyle. We come across this all the time, where people rely on notional lifestyle values put out by institutions as to, this is what an average couple lives on in retirement. Well, that's just not right, and it's not true. In fact, it's wrong. If anything, you should sit down and calculate what your lifestyle costs actually are for your lifestyle and your pursuits. So that's what we do. Fail to failure to calculate your inflation. Once again, people rely upon what is inflation out there in society, you know, and they take a notional um, basket of goods to calculate that inflation rate. The thing is though, that that basket of goods may be in no relation to how you live your life. If your pursuits are bird watching, um, mountain hiking, uh, rowing a boat, the inflation rate for the cost of those activities might be vastly different if you're a drake, a drake racer or if you're a parachutist. So once again, calculate your rate of inflation, not the notional rate. And lastly, is the big failure of working out what longevity is about. Longevity for you, your family, what's job longevity like on your side of the family, your wife's side of the family, how long do we need to make the money last? So these are, I'll put down five key areas of where we see retirement planning failing. So uh, hopefully you've got some good ideas out of this afternoon. Bye now.